Hey YouTube, Terry McClellan here in Thompson, Manitoba. Friday night there, December 2nd, just uh, starting to skin a few animals here. I uh, got a nice big uh, male marten there that I'm going to start skinning in a few minutes. Got a couple more on the board. I got a smaller female or juvenile and then I got a nice big, uh, big male there. Big guy on the right hand side there. And then down here I got a couple more dandies. I got another big male there. Uh, suitcase catch and I got another big male there suitcase catch and then I got a nice little mink there that I'm gonna skin they'll be, they're frozen they'll be ready to go for uh, tomorrow evening so I'll skin those tomorrow evening I usually try to do three or four a night I don't overdo it got all my boards and all my uh, uh, what you call it uh, belly boards there um, I notice in a few videos and pictures that I see that some guys don't use belly boards and uh, I find to just keep that skin just enough uh, light um, pulled away that uh, it makes it easier for you to uh, for you to um, pull your uh, fur off the uh, the board I've had times where uh, I've actually had to to they forgot the belly board and they get on there so tight and not knowing I've, I've cut them off and well your skin is garbage by then you get about You'll, even though the back of the fur is good, you'll get about uh, $8 or something for it. So uh, if you ever have to do that, um, an old friend of mine told me that uh, never, if you forget your belly boards for the, in this process right here, where these belly boards are, if you forget this, this process here, um, a friend of mine told me what you do is you just take a little bit of wet water, of water, mild water, whatever, warm water, and you just lightly wet it. And uh, you'll be able to pull that skin inside out no problem and get it off the board. Uh, just a little trick that he showed me so I don't have to cut them no more. But uh, yeah, I just thought I'd share that with you guys. Like I said, Friday night, just doing a little bit of skinning in my uh, garage here. Um, so far the year's going good. It's not a great year, but uh, not too bad. Um, you've, some of you have probably seen this here before, but... That's actually a picture of those lower lakes there. That's actually a picture of my trap line. Um, there is lots of water on my line. There's a, a lake called Burr Lake. There's a lake called Ospawagan Lake, Paint Lake, uh, Orr Lake, Mid Lake, Kipper Lake, Middle Lake, and a river called the Taylor River, the Burntwood River. There's all kinds of water on my line. Um, so I catch, there's lots of aquatic animals like uh, otters and beavers and uh, well muskrats, not lots of muskrats, muskrats and mink. Uh, not a lot of fisher in this area, I don't catch very many of them but uh, I got a big line. Um, the, the uh, which would be the, the west, the west part of my line which the upper part uh, is lots good timber in there. And around the park there's good timber but uh, yeah I just thought I'd show you guys that. Uh, my skinning stuff there again that big Martin that I'm gonna skin in as soon as I finish this video and a couple I said a couple big male a couple big uh, Martin there ready to turn probably uh, before I hit the hay I'll be able to turn them out and then these ones here but yeah so I just thought I'd give you a little video of what's going on um, like I said not catching lots lots but uh, it's slowly coming um, and um, I will uh, make some more videos for you hopefully tomorrow I'll have some footage for you guys I might give you some, just some footage on uh, on my line alone, and uh, we'll see uh, we'll see you guys down the line. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe when you watch these videos. Um, I go through a lot of uh, time and stuff on the line and this and that, and uh, I not begging for subscriptions, but I noticed that uh, my numbers over. I've been doing this for five years now, and I still only got 141 subscribers. Uh, where some people only have been doing it for about the same as me and they're in they're close to the thousands and it is what it is i just i like i said i'm not begging anybody if they don't want to they don't want to subscribe they don't don't have to subscribe whatever don't, doesn't matter to me but uh yeah so i'm gonna let that be all and we'll talk to you later bye